Can you uh, briefly describe what the after-tax cost of debt is? Yeah. So let's say that um, I borrow at a rate of um, six percent for easy math um, on my mortgage, and my CPA says that I'm in the thirty-three percent tax bracket. Then two percent of that is actually coming back to me as tax benefits. So six minus two would mean that my actual cost of it is really only four percent. The government is effectively subsidizing that two percent by giving you a tax break. That not only happens in mortgages, but some forms of student debt are very advantageous from a tax perspective. Not all forms. And so what you need to know is what's that after-tax cost of debt. Because sometimes if you pay down debt, you end up paying more taxes. And people have to factor that into the overall equation.